Hey guys, I'm Ramesh Shastri and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to configure your D-Link DIR816 router to your internet service provider. This is 100% compatible with your Spectral and Broadband and is also compatible with other broadband companies like Airtel, BSNL Fiber Band, and Tata Dogomo, Hathway, etc. Remember that this has a WAN entry point, so it is not a modem and hence cannot be uh, connected to a DSL or ADSL connection. So let's start configuring this model. So this is our D-Link DIR816 router. It's a dual band AC750 model. To start off with, we plug in the power cord and you see all the lights switch on and then the power light stabilizes. Next you plug in the Ethernet cable into the WAN entry point. The socket is yellow in color. And you see that there is no internet access. We are now going to configure this router for internet access. Go to your computer and in the menu area, you will have the Wi-Fi icon. Click on it. You will find a network called D-Link DIR816 5 GHz or it won't be written 5 GHz. Connect to any one of them. It's an open network and you can see that you have connected to it and then go to your web browser and type in your router's IP address that is 192.168.0.1 So you can see we have gone to the D-Link router's login page There's no password just click on login and here you will go to WAN settings there is already a connection, we are going to alter it, click on edit, change the PPPoE connection to dynamic I change that to internet connection and then you can see we have internet access. So it's very simple to configure, you can change your SSID name in wireless 2.4G, I am using firmware version 1.03 but in later firmwares it might differ. Now if you go to user index 2, you can enable your guest account. Okay, so thank you for watching my video guys. Please make sure you rate, comment, subscribe and uh, if you have any doubts feel free to comment and yeah.